guys, just with Jada Gavel here, and today I've got the tutorial for you guys on how to delete default Mac applications. So if you're like me and try and free up some hard drive space, and when you go into your applications or some kind of folder, and all you see is these default Mac applications that most of them you probably won't use that come along with iLife, um, there's a way to delete them. Although when you drop them into the trash bin, it gives you the message saying iChat can't be modified or deleted because it's required in the Mac OS X operating system. But there is a workaway around this that will allow you to fully delete these applications. First of all, you just need to go over to your utilities folder, the toolbox, whatever looking folder, click on it, and open up terminal. Let terminal pop up here. And I'm just gonna center this and open the window up for you guys. So first off, all you need to type in is CD space forward slash applications the next message will pop up and all you need to type in is ls enter and down there to delete the application you just need to type in sudo space rm space dash rf and now you need to type in the application like iChat.app. For example, any other app you can use that to the ones above in the commands. As you can see, all the apps are up here saying Lightroom, whatever. To delete the applications, you just need to type it in .app. Click enter, and then now it'll ask you for your password. And as you can see, the application is gone. It just disappeared from there. As you can see on the side, the iChat is gone. And yeah, so it's successful. All you need to do once again is type in um, cd space slash applications, and then the next command comes up, click ls, and then it'll show you all the applications there is. Look for the application you would like to download, for example, like motion.app, and you just need to type in sudo, s-u-d-o, space rm, space dash rf, space, and then the name of the application. Just highlight it and then paste it down there if you want to do. Just make sure it says the application itself and .app. Click enter, enter your password, and there you go. Your application is deleted, hopefully freeing up some hard drive space. So thanks for watching, guys. If this tutorial helped you, please make sure you like the video and subscribe for more future tutorials. If you'd like to request a tutorial, please post a comment below. Thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you in my next video.